Hasbro! The classic naval combat game, Battleship! And welcome to a game I've been wanting to record forever because I got the uh, developers sent me a key uh, earlier this month, if not last month, and I just now got to play it as, of course, the game just released today for the price of $19.99 and... It's pretty much the ship adaptation of the game Battleship. Oh, they're fine. Battleship is leveled up. Take control of commanders, roll periods of time, and play the classic game you know and love, or play the brand new commanders mode, and spend resources on special uh, and uh, and spend resources to employ special abilities. Battle in, in historic scenarios against friends, random opponents, or against artificial intelligence of the game. While completing missions to level up your rank. Will you command? Will you command to the test of time? We'll see. Actually, that's that. Yeah. Uh, but anyway, all right. So settings, of course. Not much HD rumble on and off. Okay. But yeah, I guess let's go. Actually, let's look at commanders. Inky ability, airstrike, William. Car Slake, I think. You can build the airstrike. Fire all, fire at all sails of an entire row or column of your choice. And these different pieces. Alright. Uh Joanna Smith. You can build the torpedo fire across an entire row or column, but stops when it hits the ship. Interesting. So that basically so that that allows you to clear a side of a map out. Um, alright. Zuppe? Ferrera, I think. Pro of all of them, that's probably the one I got most wrong. You can build the bombardment. Fires at a 3x3 three three area of your choice. And then the commanders we don't have yet. Okay. Yeah, it's interesting. Um, I mean, I would, I, you know, I would, $19 is, okay, maybe it's been okay for just Battleship, but it's nice that they added a, a lot more to Battleship without, well, hopefully, hopefully it doesn't really hinder the game very much, you know, like, I have never, I, whenever I try to play one of the modern Tetrises, I always don't like it because it's always not Tetris, um, to me. Um, so I love it when I get to play, I love it when they re-release the original or just graphically updated, but I don't like it when they, when they have sequels, um, but yeah. And Battleship is similar, I did, I did get the battle, I did get the old, uh, I did get the old Game Boy game on the, uh, on the Nintendo, on a, a Nintendo 3DS, no, sorry, on the Nintendo 3DS eShop, uh, eShop. And I just wanted to try Battleship out on my Switch, because that sounds like a fantastic idea. Uh, which, by the way, if you don't know what Battleship is, um, Battleship is a game in which you try to guess, you have a grid, and you try to guess where the enemy has placed their pieces on that grid. Um, each piece has a certain amount of squares, which you need to hit them all in order to win. And the goal of the game is to understand what ships you'll be facing, or pieces, what they what they look like, um, and where someone might put them on the board, and your goal is basically pepper the board until you hit something, and then just, uh, and then just take out that piece. By the way, I'm sick today, so I didn't know if I was going to be able to record before the heat of the day came, and yeah, um, it's coming up soon, because it's like, um, it's 9.34 a.m., and... I can't record when it's um, when it's over 90 outside because uh, my room heats up to my 
room essentially can't be cool anymore, which is a problem with me because I work my best under under 74 degrees. And on 74 degrees, I can tolerate it, but I don't work very well and then I actually overheat up at uh, uh, degrees above 90. 80 is in that weird zone where I just don't get cool. Um, so I just feel terrible, but anyway. So game modes. In Battleship, you can play Classic Mode or Commander's Mode. Commander's Mode is a more tactical variation of the game where you play with new ship shapes. Different ship grids and can spend energy to activate special abilities. There's, I don't see anything wrong with that. Um, so let's play classic mode to start off with, then we'll play commando. Commanders. And uh, basically just different backgrounds. You know what? You don't get to see these guys very often, so let's play with that as background. And everyone has the same, everyone has the classic ship fleets, they just have different skins. Uh, but you yeah, know, that's nice! Uh, they can play the original mode, and you can play essentially Going by the same rules, but you no, know, with at uh, but with different ships for you to memorize, which is nice. No, I'll go with the classic fleet. Yeah, I'll go with the classic fleet. Oh, I can I not pick my opposing commander? That kind of sucks. Hot medium. For each battle position, you can change the position of your ships. Press. A to grab shifts. Okay, that's an interesting way to show a control stick that doesn't actually rotate, um, but it you push it to the side, but anyway, um, L to move them and Y to rotate them. Okay. Well, I mean, it's more classic. I'm not quite sure what you are supposed to be. Y is okay. Let's put this up uh, over here. And basically, you don't want to make it easy on the uh, easy for you don't want to make it easy for easy for your opponents. So like putting you on a corner is not exactly the best idea in the world. Although you might although it might work, but still. Yeah, you definitely don't want to cluster. Nice that they show you all the controls on screen. There's no reason not to, and let's go. Here we go first. How to play. The goal of the game is to find and sink the enemy, sh the enemy ships before they can find and sink yours. Once you're off for a turn, you get to fire a single shot every turn. Select the cell with the left stick and press A to fire. Oh, uh, let's start off with right there. Nope. Oh, yeah, and the pigs stay on the map. Now, some iterations of the game have it, so if you hit if you hit by something, it, uh, it actually uh, notifies you, but that's a bit easier. Okay. Oh, there it is. All right. Now we hit something, but we don't know what it is, so we don't know which direction to go, which gets even weirder in, um, if you... Uh, if you play the other content, I would imagine. Alright, bonus shot. You get a single shot bonus every time you hit a ship with a single shot. Press A to fire again. Okay. Oh, I can't remember that's actually in the uh, board game or not. I really have board. Uh, yeah, it is kind of a board game, but yeah. Um, I want to right there. There we go. There we go again. Oh, wow. I'm saying that is one of their threes. Or maybe it's a four, but now the question is, which way did they go? Um, you know what? Let's say they put it more towards the middle. There we go. That's the carrier. And I'm saying it's more in the middle. Ah, oh, I, I, I kind of have a feeling that was a, that was a bad move. Well, let's take the carrier. Oh yeah, let's take the carrier. Oh, they put it on top, okay. There we 
we go. Oh, it doesn't actually show a carrier. Well, there goes the carrier. Um. Okay, let's clear it out because we know that these probably don't have any ships in it. Um, so, you know what? Let's actually go here. Nope. Well, I might figure out my carrier soon enough. I'm thinking working work di I'm thinking work to diagonals. Ah, uh, I mean, then I just broke. What was you saying? Uh oh, they found a car. Man, the AI plays little games with carriers. Seeing if my piece is connected, and now we and now we get to see how advanced the AI is or not. Right there. I almost put a ship there too. They might actually. I'm thinking they actually. I think I'm thinking they used the edges a lot because there's nothing really in the center. So let's try hitting the edges. Right next to Kerr. Nope. I almost switched ships there. But anyway, Battleship is a game of chance and strategy. Oh, really? Okay. I really want to check to see if my carrier was guarded by anything. But well, you may see me. I'm. You maybe see I'm. The fact that I'm missing, but I'm actually trying to. I'm, well, I'm actually kind of making. I'm trying to make it so. Um. The, so there's not much room for the ships to hide after the battery. Is that right there? Ooh! I was trying. I was hoping I got something there. Well, there's big enough space to hide something between those two shots. Um, over here. There we go. Um, it's it, it could be a sub, which subs are if you ever played Battleship before, they're the crazy ones. So AF car, I saw all the carriers, but since you can chain your attacks in this game, carriers are nothing. Um. Unless you pick the wrong direction, of course. Like I did, actually. Um, like, it could be anywhere. Uh, I'm thinking it's there for some reason. Ah, uh, no, it isn't. Had a feeling, alright. I still want to do it anyway. Alright, so now let's go here. The ironic one? No, no, I actually wasn't that. I actually was further out than I thought. Oh no! I don't know, they did change the models or something. Yeah, I, I don't think I like the whole once you hit something, you just, you just drowned it. Um, it makes for a faster game. Okay, shift it to the side. It makes for a much faster game. But, uh, you know, it's not like, it's not, it doesn't have like that tension of will he hit it after all kind of thing. It's another three. Oh no, they are, they are modeled to the, um, the ship that you're actually using or something like it. Um, uh, but yeah. Okay, we need to hurry up. How about right here? Nope. Although it is really gratifying when you hit something and your controller rumbles. And you hear that sound. Yep, that's the only way they could have done it. I mean, yeah, he's actually pretty good. 
Oh no. Okay, good. But this game does introduce a new type of tension. And actually, no, we haven't touched this roll at all. Nope. And he knows, yeah. Be nice if there's a way to turn off that. That will cost experience. Well, I mean, or at least that's how I always played it. If this was always an actual rule, I... Um... Uh, no, I can test. Okay, let's put it... Because nothing can exist here other than the sub. Uh... I'm still thinking they put everything around the carrier. Which might not be the, which might not be the case. Although they... Although we got one ship left. I mean, this is just how Battleship plays. Um... Uh, is you do really well, but they do, but they can also do pretty well. Nope. Oh, really? And they got us. I good game, but I I really don't think I don't I really don't think I like that mechanic. Ah, uh, yeah, edge and then in the corner. I wish that stayed on the screen longer. Okay, I guess that's destroying you if you were playing normal. And it has the uh, mobile game ranking system, but no microtransactions because it's on the Switch. I mean, unlocked, yay! Okay, so it has the more... It has the... Addicting... I don't want to say... Addicting is a bad word in this context. Um, It didn't used to really be a bad word in gaming until, you know, mobile games showed up. But it has the... Um, getting... It has... This, it has an unlocking system that will keep you engaged. Um... So let's uh, try the new mode. Because there's not that much time for today. Enhanced. <laughs> That's what you call enhanced? <laughs> you know what? I want to try one with the whole mill. <laughs> I want to try the more, uh, more older style fleet against the newer fleets. But yeah, I mean, like... The, the mechanic of you get fired, uh, once you get something, you try again and again and again. Actually, that might have been always a thing. Um, uh, but, no, I think about it, but... It really makes sense when you add, uh, when you add this nonsense to the mix. Now let's do the Tetris Peace guy. Oh, man, this map. Actually, let's go anti what you would expect. Oh, that, that's glorious. Okay. Now I'm going to keep you here. And there's always the nice thing of when you hit when you hit a ship. Um, you know, when you when when you hit a chain of ships. Again, let's go against what they would expect. There you go. Who leaves the corner? Man, uh, no, the game is fun and I did have a fair defeat. Oh yeah, might as well just start right there. Nope. Oh, in turn because you can use abilities, okay. Um, let's see, it's for abilities, gotcha. But no, I really like this. This is, to me, it's worth $19, because, I mean, don't technically need to see more of this. Uh, more content is always, be is always good content, but, uh, but, you know, it's, uh, it, it's Battleship. If, if you're getting this, you're getting to play it over and over and over again. Um, with the added bonus of having online and hot seat. 
well, maybe not hot seat. Maybe we'll see. Actually, no, I'll see. There's hot seat. Hot seat. Hot seat. By the way, is passing around the controller, passing around the keyboard and mouse. Um, let's put it here. Hit. Uh, you have two twos. You have a corner. You have a Technomicon, and then you have. Uh, I think you have a pointer finger. Uh, here. Oh, there we go. Was that two? No, it's not. Okay, so it could be a Tetronomicon. Or a corner. Uh. I, yeah, I was not thinking about it. I was not thinking that. I should, I should go with my feelings instead of anything else. Alright. Uh, it won't do anything. No, I want to keep building and see what we can get later. Okay, that was smart. Well, SNG, you earn better SNG when the enemy when the enemy hits one of your ships. You get extra one energy for each hit. Interesting. Fair bet, fair bet, enemy commander. Okay, it could, it could be their big ship, but I'm going to guess it's not. It's not. I mean, could uh, actually could be. Okay, uh, it's not the corner, it has to be the, uh, it has to be the, um, Tetris piece. No? Where in the world are you then? Unless it's, it, no, it can't be the two twos because I hit one. Uh, I would have sunk one. Oh, will I be able to figure it out? Yep. And, you know, I don't feel like the AI is cheating. You know, I feel like where they figure this out is the question. Up. Ah, oh, they thought they thought I put it on the thing. I almost did that. Alrighty. Capability, yay! Well, it's just unique capability. Okay, oh, okay, you can actually get checked. Okay, mine place it on your own grid, mine fires too. Retaliatory shot, a <laughs> random one hit. Oh wow. No, oh, that's pretty not a terrible idea right about now. Oh, you can't place on your own ship, okay. Okay. I'm thinking put it there. Put mine there, um, in case they in, in case they think it's going to continue upwards. Um, sonar shows no more damage ship pieces and mines surrounding a white piece of white salvage choice. Okay. Bomb fire fire four shots at a two by two area of your choice or airstrike. Fire on all sails in the entire roll column of your choice. Yes. Right there. Yeah, the double press it, just be sure. Okay. I hit a three. There's only one that could be. That means it has to be here. Yeah. Ooh, it's facing the other direction. Oh, that was smart. Yeah, I like the, I like I like I, I like this version of the game. It's fun. I, gosh, I know you're really smart there, but anyway, right here, got the big guy. Oh, it's facing to the side. I got one there. I got the little guy. Okay, that confused me. No, it's a Tetronomicon. Then one wolf's up there. And you know what? It could be a corner facing the wrong direction. Yeah, they got it now. Yeah, I, I like how the AI is actually playing to win. Uh oh. Okay, it has to be this. 
Didn't think anything. Okay. It's not the two twos. You know what? I'm gonna. You know what? I am going to. Call in support. There we go. What in the world's over there? Get that then! There we go! Is this head covering it? Oh! I'm being dumb! I, I'm i being dumb! I forgot this is the Tetronomicon! That's the big boy! Oh, that confused me. That confused me terribly. Unless it's the Tetronomicon, that's the corner? No, the corner will be... Please hold. There you go, that's the corner. That's the corner. That's the attention wrong con. Oh, oh, you know, you know what it is? It's facing horizontally. Right there. There we go. Is this the sea slope? Kind of, yeah. All right. Oh, we can't call for support. Uh, now we got to hunt down the last sub like piece. Um, you know what, just because... Nope. I had to clear that corner just in case. Well, in case they put it in the corner for reasons. Oh, wow. Well, okay, we need to... Use some sonars. I want, I want to clear this on. Oh, you have to do a run the peg. So I have to use up a pig, okay. Well, that's the case, let's use up a pig. Well, if that's the case, let's use up a pig. Nothing. Or low none. Oh, wait, no. It found one. Okay, missed uh, what piece it was, or if it had one chip. Oh! Well played, well played. It found two. Alright, let's use the ability bomb. Our four shots, that's if you two or you have a choice. Right there. Got it! That was like a good sonar. There we go! Actually, I should have realized that. If it had found two, which probably the number of me might have detected, I won't show it to you. Which is smart. It, 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 um, it adds to the game battleship instead of kind of taking it away with kind of easiness. Um, or casualization, as people like to say. All right. And, yeah, that's pretty much what the Nintendo Switch version of Elchip is. It's just a great, it's just a great addition to... Um, the long line, uh, it's, it's a great addition, it's a great addition to the game. And I really like it. Uh, I would definitely say it's worth $19, uh, player friends. If you're enjoying a game to play with your friend each on your own console, or play local player on the Nintendo Switch using companion app. Really? Okay. Why doesn't this game have hot seat? I mean, um, developers, I would love a, I, I would love if you could update the game and have a hot seat mode, where essentially it's like single player, but you, but you could, but you play as the AI as well. Um, but you know, uh, this is definitely an excellent, you know, this is definitely an excellent digital adaptation of a battleship. Um, definitely worth it to anyone that ever wanted to play battleship or has always wanted to play battleship online. Or just wants to end the game on their Switch, or wants to play Battleship on their Switch. Um, and it's just a nice, good, you know, simple, art, uh, arcade party, um, um, strategy game. Alright, that'd be it for this video. Thanks for watching. Um, we do appreciate watching you know, this video. It means a lot to me. It also means a lot to me if you were to check out the stuff on the screen. And I guess, see you in screen.